What's up, it's some dude named Devs, and today I'm going to do a Photoshop tutorial. So I know times are tough right now and we're kind of stuck inside our houses. So I kind of want to show you a little way to up your game a little bit on some previous photos you probably are already taken. Basically, we're going to do something like this and something like this. This is a super easy tutorial. Um, all you really need is Photoshop and honestly, we'll probably knock this out in five minutes. All right, so we're gonna be doing two versions of this effect. Um, one is merging two photos together, and then two is just kind of doing this, just the same person, but like ghosting it behind it. All right, so we are gonna merge two photos together. Basic first thing we're gonna do Hit the quick select tool. Essentially just pick out the person that you want to ghost. This has to be super perfect, but make sure you don't get like stuff like this in here. Like the chair, for instance. This one's a little more difficult because there's a lot of, uh, there is a lot of objects in here or textures at least. All right, so I got my subject selected here. On Mac, Command C, Command V. So now you have a replica of him, right? Now we're going to our other photo, him sitting forward. So it doesn't have to be the same like picture. It could honestly be two other pictures if you wanted to. I like to do, I like to merge two photos that are relatively similar. pretty good. Alright, so I like the way he looks here. So I'm probably gonna have this as our main photo. So command C, command V. So now you have that layer right here, right? Sorry. Go back to your old photo, grab this layer, drag that right on over to the other. Boom. So now he's right here. Perfect. Now you're gonna hit command T. You can recenter him by that chair again. See how like he's already sitting in that chair? Perfect. Hit enter. Basically, all I'm gonna do is slide this layer right under this layer, and that's basically pretty much it. Um, what I can do, shift it over a bit, like that. You know what I'm saying? Hit enter. Command J, I'm gonna Command J that one. Take this one, yeah, edit, transform, flip horizontally. So now he's looking, that one's looking the other way. Command T, move that on over just a little bit. Sometimes I don't really like to make it even. Make one just a little smaller. Cool, hit enter. And then just change that, up, change that opacity. I usually do like a 20, 20 region looks pretty good. Go to this other layer, remember, this other side, the left side. Bring that down. That could be even less than 20, like a 15 looks pretty good. And that's pretty much it, man. And then that's that's the ghost. Super simple. Um, if you want, you can kind of clean up the feet here. So this was an ad I did. Um, I actually shot a video for Adidas and WSS, so they probably wanted the shoes to be more highlighted, which they did. Um, again, doesn't have to be perfect. As long as you see the shoes a little better, especially for it adds. There you go. So now you have the top part that's there with that, and I think it looks awesome. This is with it, without it. And then again, the re you have to keep this top layer here or else it's gonna be all over his face, you don't want that. I hope you guys liked this tutorial. Super easy, takes honestly like five minutes. Use your old photos, spruce them up just a little bit. Um, use hashtag some edit. Post it on Instagram, DM me, send it over. Love to see what you guys pulled off. 
And uh, yeah, stay creative during this tough time. See you guys.